See, this thing's kind of scary, right? Like, it's got eyes that are all sad and a mouth that's all tortured. What? No, this is, is it? This is not scary. This is our creepy shit. This yeah, is spoopy. But... This is spoopy. Yes, that's exactly what this is. This is spoopy. It's not scary. I mean, it's just, how can you not love this shit? Keep the blood pumping and just like a cartoon heart. I, I don't I even love know what's the going on. The game is like trying to encourage you. Okay, you're not too scared. Hang in there. It'll be okay. And you're like, what? But we haven't got to the scary part yet. So is the Resident Evil door just after every elevator? <laughs> I like the things that are haunting me. Rutzkarn's like, ah, ha, ha, it's cute. <laughs> is this like a, a day in the Adams Family Mansion for you, Chris? I'm like one. Of, I'm like one of the normies that tries to go to the Adams Family Mansion and just gets scared. And they're like, hey, would you like some popcorn? And they're like, sure. And you're like, the popcorn is spiders. And you're like, what? <laughs> That's every episode of The Abbs Family. <laughs> you're welcome. But they're really cute spiders. I feel like I've seen this ex like, like that exact environment in so many indie horror titles. Just like, ooh, spooky white glowy area. We don't have any idea. What well, does it count as them not having any ideas here, or are they just making fun of it? See, there's a hanging I, man. I, That's I actually creepy. don't think either. Hammond. Yeah. It's a I picture mean, of a hanging it's a man. Painting it's, about... it, it's a little ominous, maybe. It's a bit eerie. Macabre. It's a, here. It's a this, painting you of see this the game hanging. Behold man. this picture of something that can't happen to you in this game. You have a oh, flashlight. Oh my god, they gave you a flashlight! <laughs> okay, I don't know why you guys are laughing. This is anything, the scariest but... part of the game for me. I don't like ghosts, okay? I Okay, oh, man. I like I I really do I, I really do enjoy games when they start playing with light and shadow so i approve here although i can't really feel play like with light and shadow the flashlight isn't casting any shadows look at yeah, the box yeah. well you know but oh just... japanese text yep yeah they're just running down the checklist of here is everything you need in a game that is scary it's like somebody deliberately wanted to take all the the famously scary ele elements and combine them. Oh, hey, cool. Oh, it's, man, it's, it's, it's not wait, scary. it's the Metro Ghosts. No, you Come don't back. want to look at them. If you look at them, they... Oh, Jesus, okay, God! Go say hi. <laughs> <laughs> Was that Pinkie Pie on the wall there? Or Rainbow Dash? Okay, so... I guess you have Draw to go in all these the rooms. Board. Do you have to go in all these rooms and look around, Chris? Because this seems like you're inflicting this on yourself. No, you have to find the key. And now there's an evil lady. Uh-oh. Uh oh, God. Oh, God. She's gone. Oh, oh Jesus. God, lady. I'm gonna... You're scared of ladies, right? <laughs> <laughs> I've gotten what I wanted out of this. Guys are dicks. Oh god, she's still there! She's still there! She's still there! This game what is worth the your, money. What happened to your flashlight? I'm feeling robbed here. We had a flashlight. How much did Chris? How much money did Chris spend on this? Because every it, money Chris it's spent. It's free. Was well the spent. game is free. <laughs> Even I, I think better. you should donate something, Chris.
Yep, still chasing you. What if she chases you into the elevator at the end of the level? We got 25 rooms to go. And it just turns out she just wanted you to, like, wait, hold the elevator for her. <laughs> That's rude. Just, like, She's sitting there in the elevator with you, like, tapping her foot, like... Man, I wish this elevator was gone. And you're like, I really hope she doesn't need to get off on my floor. This is so awkward. <laughs> okay, I think that's it. So what if she gains and like, speed every time you go through a door? Really lame elevator. Alright, Chris, you're out. safe. I think it's pretty safe to, you know, take your sense of security and just go ahead and lull it. Just, just stick it right yeah. in a lull. Yep, you are safe, Put and there will be no over. further danger from now on. You know what? Congratulations, Chris. Uh, I think you've beat the scary part of the game. I, th I think you're through now oh, to yeah. the... Uh, qu quietly exploring a safe house game. Part two. The house dicks. that was very safe. What? Wait, that skeleton that has a note for you. And the skeleton jumped out of a railing. How did that work? It's... I was thinking games, uh, games, you know, I gotta say games lose me a little bit, but it can easily bring it back in uh, the next 20 rooms or so. Did you know that this death is kind of romantic? You know what else is romantic? L scary pits. ghost ladies trying to murder camps. Really too. deep pits. I I'm glad you can't fall in because that might make this in some way tense. Oh, I think you can. Yeah. No, you can't. It's a wall. Oh. Like, imagine if you were being chased here and you had to worry about falling off the edge so you couldn't go too fast. Captain's law. A little early there, stump. God damn it. They're not getting me. Like, that was definitely too early. Did you miss yeah, the, the spider was better. Wow, I, they're I, trying I, hard on this. I'm, I'm blocking them out. Well, we got our jump scares back. Okay, but what if he just, like, walks down the hallway, and instead of a spider cutout, it's just, like, a giant, horrible spider crawling on the walls to kill him? That would actually be, be a cool. great subversion. Like, over and over again, it jump scares you with cartoon spiders, and then it's just, like, a real, like, that's, semi photo yeah, That's why I'm, I'm getting behind this game, is because it's been doing, like, comedy horror, like, in a, kind of a sly way that's been charming me. But I'm also, like, putting a big outside okay, bed that's on creepy. horrible subversion. Yeah, it's, that's a little creepy. What? It's wearing a bonnet. Okay, that's Did actually I less creepy. Did I die here in another game? Also, the aggressively two-dimensional aspect of it. Did I die and turn into a sprite here in another game life? Oh yeah, I played Reginald Cuthbert again, uh, this, in, in uh, the space game, LARP again. So, um, there is a player versus an environment challenge where you could go through a lot of trouble to help repair the, just like, slowly degenerating atmosphere plant that's keeping everyone on the planet alive, or there are a few ways to sabotage it. So, that's what I spent the whole night doing, obviously. So. Right, naturally. It was supposed it was like if you work kinda of hard and get your resources together, you can complete this once. And if you really sort of go hard, you can do it twice. So I blew it up four different times. <laughs> <laughs> they put me on trial for it because everyone was saying, like, you keep blowing up the, they're like, let the record show you've said eight times that you've been blowing up the plant, you know. You, you specifically said, I blew up the generator twice. And I was like, yeah, but it's, um, you can't be tried for the same crime twice. It's double jeopardy. So technically it's... Uh... <laughs> so... Ultimately, ultimately they came great. back with a verdict of guilty, but we're not oh, punishing God. him because it's not going to stop him. That is the perfect way to deal with Cuthbert. All right, now look at this. All of a sudden, it like is doing a little. Trying to do a Dark rip. Souls character that just magically emits light for no reason. I mean, this is. I mean, that's just how darkness works in those shitty old games where they just darkness was just black fog. This is very like Silent Hill here. 
broken. Oh yeah, no, this, this, broken. this looks like this could just be from Silent Hill One, basically. Right, this could be like Silent Hill Zero, like some one generate graphical generation earlier than the original. Wasn't there actually a Silent Hill Zero or like a game I don't named know. That? I don't know what they did with that poor series. It's a yeah. it's a freaking pachinko machine now. A pachinko machine. <laughs> I quit oh, video man. games. Silent forever. Hills. I really I... appreciated the Twitter debates Nero about the canonicity of the Silent Hill pachinko machine. Oh, it's Han Solo. There were frozen in carbonite. So you gotta save him from Jabba the Hutt. What are you That's doing, Dancer? Answer your question, Josh. They were aggressively sarcastic debate. Oh, okay. Oh, just the pachinko. Uh, I clean up. Because I wasn't aware Silent Hill had a cannon. I haven't gotten this far yet, so. Huh. Okay, now, yeah, even now the we're notes in the, final were Silent the Hill. found footage. So now we're doing what looks like found footage stuff. So we did the Japanese horror. Sort of marble hornets. Oh, Jesus! And then oh, we Jesus! Was oh, Jesus! Gonna show up. I think that was supposed to be Silent Hill Mist. <laughs> oh, I see. It was like fog. <laughs> Shut up! Still, it feels God like we need, like... You can just see Chris's pee all over the wall. It looks like a naked you Slender suck. Man. You can go to hell. <laughs> People are like, why do you guys keep doing horror games and go making back. fun of them? Oh, this is Jesus. why. Go. Hey, Chris, go uh, back. I don't know. Oh, the walls are going to turn into a blood disco, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Jesus, God. Run out the hole or run out the door that got open. Oh, quick over tell that. To jump up your butt. Shake the mouse and the screensaver. <laughs> <laughs> Crispy all over the wall. I was I was a little bit like, oh man, this doesn't seem like a very good horror game. But now I'm into it. I think the one thing that I, this game does really well that really makes me appreciate it is makes Chris squeal. Like that's that's definitely the <laughs> draw. For put me. that on the box. Actually, just the the trailer should just be this screen with Chris <laughs> saying, "Oh Jesus!" <laughs> like, that's, like that that's on a loop. Laughing in minutes. the background. <laughs> it's, and then people ask like, "Why it's we're not so in hard the game?" To find the doors when everything oh, so becomes wait, blood. Wait a minute. So the audio. <laughs> that should be we on the, the back audio of the box. No, 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 no. The contract that no, no. says technically no, we have to match this up no. one to one with the video, right? So we could just take Chris's babbling and put it over like whenever a spider appears and just make a super cut of that. <laughs> oh shit, all the doors are locked. <laughs> it's so hard to find the doors when everything's blood. That's, that's your back of the box quote. <laughs> Okay, I'm getting dizzy. This is... It's seizure-inducing, it really is. I can't like, imagine I'm getting why. kind of a headache. Okay, it's over. I think it's over. Yeah, it's over. You can relax now. Nothing more will happen that is strange or unpleasant. You're good now. It's almost safe. Just relax. Let your guard down. Just take that guard and just yeah. lay it on the ground and give it a gentle pat. Maybe put your foot on top of it. A lovely garden in the forest. Chris, I want you to just, garden just drink. Just drink some water. Just drink a bottle of water. Just chug it down. That urine is safe and sound <laughs> in your bladder. Your, bl your bladder is a bank. Look at that, you just got ten more rooms to go and you get to the elevator. If he ever gets out of here... <laughs> ten more rooms. Hey, there you go. You know, I'm pretty sure they've run out of ideas by now. There's not gonna be anything else spooky. Yeah, yeah it's pretty yeah. much done. Oh, it's a guy locked. there congratulating okay. you for you know, beating the spooky game. Then the credits will roll. We did our damnedest, but Chris Chris was unfazed. Kudos. I personally congratulate you. Life will have no more terrors for you now. 
Chris, you're awfully quiet. Did you mute your Has microphone? Chris been replaced by the Slender Man. No, I keep. Uh, uh oh. Uh. Listen, you made it this far. That's, uh, that's great. Okay. I shall grant you a It's fine. I don't like this. Oh. So, uh, so just keep going. <laughs> Oh, you, you don't want a gift? Just... Open it. Hey. Oh, that's not so bad. I actually really dig that painting on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't so bad. I was really ter prepared to turn around and see a giant spider, and instead it's more wooden cutouts. <laughs> <laughs> this game just keeps on giving. What's that sound? I'm not uh, sure I want to just the thing about to tear Chris apart, asshole, first. It's fine. I think you should find out. It's important. Our viewers expect. What are the holes in the ceiling? Do things fall out of the holes in the ceiling under your head? Maybe. But he can't look at his head, so maybe. Yes, like yes, a yes, 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 yes. Yes, they fall. Yes, like, like, things tons come of out. Spiders. And <laughs> 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 they were spiders. I knew it. Yeah, this game does not have Did a lot to work with. I guess that was the room with the girl. Huh. Did that? Oh, okay. I like that this game has a stamina meter. Yeah. You can run, but not too much. It's actually a really generous stamina. I know, which kind of makes me question its existence and necessity. Uh, it? Yeah, it's almost enough to What should it. I do? I can't let you do that, Dave. That does. Modify the access to specimen access, database. Yeah, access to specimen database. It's, yeah, it's all urine specimens. specimens. Cat dolls, cat dolls. The load of the world, little cat dolls. Oh, shit. Huh. Have you, uh, has the thing attacked you yet? Also, does it, like, are you clicking out of these? Yeah, that was the these? first thing, and this is the second thing. Are you clicking out of these, Chris? Because it's really brief. Yeah, yeah you, you can't stand to look at them for too long. 14th century spirit. And that was the slender See, but, but is this just to get you to stand still so something can sneak up behind you? Is that what this is about? <laughs> uh, normally I'm against like that kind of cheap, like crass that. jump scare, but since Chris is playing the game, I think that would be pretty good. Yeah, like, because you can't even turn your head. Like, if there was something behind you right now, there'd be no way to look behind oh. you. Specimen underscore. Specimen number nine. A little bit of Monica by your side. You know what, check I, the I other don't know specimens. You don't modify I just, the... I, I just fucked up hardcore. Wait, what's enter do there? Modify house layout? Hey, why don't you just put the... Next, like, right next to Wait, you. Wait, what's specimen 7 and 8? You skipped them. <laughs> huh. huh. Spaghetti. Tapestry. Nothing more terrifying. So now the game is like trying to pull an SCP. I want to say parody. Oh, I don't know. I don't know what SCP it is. secure, contain, protect. Oh, I don't know anything about that. Is that one of your nerd games? Wait a minute. <laughs> Specimen ten we saw before. It was different. Come back. Check specimen ten again. Next time on spoiler warning. Wasn't it? Chris, like, 
Chris looks on the internet while we make fun of him. <laughs> oh, there's a Wikipedia page on lathes? I want to see that. Well, no, go back. No, go back. Okay. But go back, though. Chris, you've been ruffled quiet lately. Do you have any opinions? Any thoughts you want to share? I guess not. Is he muted? Maybe he's dead. The game is playing itself. I think maybe he's muted. <laughs> he's just really pissed off at us. Yeah, no, he keeps he keeps hitting his microphone, but he's not saying anything. Oh, somebody killed Chris. Nobody That's killed it. me. I'm just. <laughs> Shift is my push to talk key <laughs> and my run key. I have to be judicious about its use. Oh, it's fine, Chris. What about this game has made you think that you'll need to sprint in an opportune moment? Well, we'll be talking over it at the time. Good answer. So I think we've um, outlasted the game's spookiness. Yeah. Although maybe we should unless it's building you up or something. Let Let's try and make it to room uh, three hundred. It's only a few. More. Yep. Come Although back with the shield or without rooms, that shield. These fog rooms are actually really time consuming and boring. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I don't know if my outside bet is going to pay off, but... Like, I don't even know the objective of these fog rooms. I know they're, like, really boring. It's like a David Lynch film without the content. So, a David Lynch film, then? Mm. <laughs> Harsh. Well, we're back in the brain room, so... Yay! Hey! What about you, Brain? Any ideas? No? Oh, Thanks. So. Hey! Oh my god, we got this damn room. I don't know if this is supposed to be creepy, oh, wow. but it's basically just heavy. You got it on the first try. That was pretty impressive. Yeah. Starting to get the hang of these. You know, if nothing scary happens between or funny happens between now and room 300, we're probably just gonna have to cut this entire episode. <laughs> hey, there's a chair. Why don't you just you know, take a load off? You've earned it. Take a rest. Put your feet up. You know, make some cocoa. Tilt back in the chair. Yeah, just you know, kind of rock back and forth in the chair. You've earned it. Oh, come on. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> this game doesn't respect your time. I'll bet you you like, can't oh God, do that he's making exact really same quickly. thing again. There's no way you'll be so, able to do it again. So, how many of these rooms do you think he'll do with the expectation that there's going to be something novel eventually? 99. You can take your hands away from your sensitive organs. Oh! This pl place has finally started to affect me. You know, it's funny that, that that note should appear when the opposite should be taking effect. Yeah. Well, so that I, I have to say, this, this game is breaking down a little bit for me at this point, which is unfortunate. Yeah. Yeah. That was Spoopy's house of whatever. But it came from GL Labs, Seamus. <laughs> Campster got really scared. <laughs> that is scary. I would have rather had something from HF Labs. I, I want a sign that says programmed entirely in OpenGL 1.0. That would be the most terrifying thing they could hang up in here. 
Oh, and now it turns into a roguelike, obviously. Programmed entirely in 3D FX Glide. Oh, you know, okay. Chris, speed 3D run. 3D FX Glide is dead. Wait, is this the same thing? Do, do. We're, yes. we're, we're 25 minutes. I think we've seen everything this thing has to offer. Yeah. <laughs> I was really holding out for just one more jump scare, but I guess something I like know. that's not going to boo. That was a really sad attempt, Rutzgarn. <laughs> I'm not Rutzgarn. Rutzgarn's dead. I'm the thing that murdered Rutzgarn. Rutzgarn's not here me? anymore. You can't be me because I'm me. <laughs> <laughs> be careful when you Unless take a shower because the tub is slippery and you might fall. Uh. Huh. Oh. I don't know what a horrible evil I'm about to awake. So. Wow, this game just became slightly interesting again. This is gonna be bad, isn't it? Uh. This. This is. Starting to get into creepy pasta territory. Yeah. I like all the attention that you lavished on those last notes, Chris. Some dude wrote some shit, and Did I didn't know the pay school attention. Door is locked. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are into this. I'm feeling kind of underwhelmed here. I'm feeling robbed. Oh, don't worry. We're super underwhelmed. Yours. Years, God, I can't hold it up while holding down the shift key, so I can't read it out loud. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you put, if you put it up, uh, I'll read it. Oh, it's this guy from Zelda. I'm gonna not want to die. Yeah, it's oh okay. You know what? That's actually we're done here. Right then, right there. That's it. Not move after it's over. over. Oh god, oh god, he does the thing where you turn and he's there. He does the Sherlock Holmes thing. Oh my god. <laughs> he's Watson! Oh my god, I just died. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you got Slenderman. Oh my god, he's gonna put a needle in my Red eye. Ball. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> this game just got real. <laughs> Got dark as shit. Eh. You know, I'm disappointed. That was the end of Camster. Your soul wonders an endless maze. That's what we've been doing. I would expect oh, Dev to put an end to that. And on that sick burn, good night. <laughs> and that is the spooky game of uh, spooky.